Hey sleepyheads out there, I'm Dave We Like, and yes, I too have terrible nights of sleep. I constantly wake up uh, where I have stiff necks and other stiff parts of me. So let's go ahead and talk about what's going on with my body. Well, Jimmy, when you turn a certain age, you might feel certain things. In all seriousness, though, we've got the Pillow Cube, the original one. It's about 12 inches, and they have two particular models. There's the 5 inch as well as the 6 inch. I went with the 6 inch version just because I'm like, yeah, you know, that ratio, it makes sense. Let's go with the 6 inch. I, I don't know. I, I didn't measure myself uh, ahead of time, but I just have to assume bigger is better. They do have a 28 inch model as well, which is more in the shape of a rectangle than a cube. I just didn't want to wait around for it, so I, I really wanted to play around with this cube-shaped pillow that just sounds so intriguing. Here's my general unboxing, and uh, let's open it up. I mean, I do like the box because it just tells you really fast, pillow cube, sleep into the future, and it says thank you, as well as uh, gives you the directions, ultimately, of what to do and what not to do with your particular pillow. You want to take it out of that plastic bag that it comes in and let it sit there for about 20 minutes so it can soak in the, the air. I mean, ultimately, this is a memory foam pillow, so it needs to do so. And then also, it might have some sort of plasticky smell to it, so you might want to air it out for a little bit longer than that. In the second bag, we're going to find our cover that we're going to put on the pillow, of course, and I believe both the memory foam as well as the cover itself are made and meshed with bamboo, which I personally like just simply because it makes it that much cooler to the touch. Um, but that being said, let's actually put it to the test right now and sit on my mattress or lie down on my mattress. Now, here's the key thing to look at. As you can watch me lie in my bed, you'll notice the compression of the pillow. And it's slightly different depending on what side I'm sleeping on, whether or not it's my back or my left or right sides, as well as even my stomach. And you'll see very quickly that the compression is pretty severe, all right? So I went with the six inch version thinking that it's gonna stay at six inches but it really, really compresses down to like maybe three to four inches. Even though that there is a pretty significant amount of compression here, I will say though that I do feel a lot of the pressure being relieved on my shoulders. No matter what kind of pillow it is that you use, you know, fluff and fold all night, wasting all this sort of time and energy on doing that to try and get into that right position. And with the pillow cube, you won't have to do that because it generally stays in that form of a cube. I have tried out the pillow cube for the last several nights and I will say this much that I don't feel secure when I try and sleep on my sides. And I'm just saying that because it's not that large of a pillow. Sleeping on my side like that, you know, if you rock back and forth in the middle of the night, you'll just like fall off the pillow. I have been able to go to bed very easily just simply lying on my back. And that's the thing that's really, really nice. I, I feel completely supported in that position. You know, my body's not going to twist around all that much uh, in the middle of the night when I'm lying on my back. And I really feel like my head is just kind of locked into place. So yes, ultimately there are some flaws with Pillow Cube. Again, uh, the temperature, it's memory foam, so you will kind of heat up a little bit. That's why I'm also using an additional bamboo layer. That way I can go ahead and cool down the pillow as much as possible. I'm not waking up with any sort of like neck sweats by any means, um, so I guess it's kind of working. Finally, it's about that ultimate feeling of being supported, which again, in certain positions, being on the sides, I'm not exactly feeling, but on the Backside, I totally like. I do think that the pros outweigh the cons here simply because, you know, I feel as if I'm sleeping throughout the, the entire night. I'm not waking up with pain in my neck and everything's kind of working as I would hope it to. You know, I'm, I'm getting a pretty good night's sleep with this pillow, surprisingly enough. If you have any questions about the Pillow Cube, let me know in the comment section below, as well as go ahead to subscribe to this channel for more videos coming soon.